so students we are going to take a look at one example uh, this is a similar example as the previous one uh, but we need to calculate is the hydrodynamic entry length so the hydrodynamic entry length is required okay so what is given given is that water is at 20 degree centigrade so at 20 degree centigrade using a table the density comes out to be 998 kilogram per meter cube and the dynamic viscosity comes out to be uh, 0.001002 kilogram per meter per second so what is the hydrodynamic entrance or entry region LH is required for part A and part C okay so part A is when the pipe diameter is 2 cm so when the pipe diameter is 2 cm Reynolds numbers RE is equals to rho V average into T over viscosity so this comes out to be 998 into 0 0.02 into 0 0.02 this is the velocity 0 0.02 cm per second and the diameter is 2 cm divided by 100 equals to 0 0.02 meter whole divided by the viscosity so the normal number comes out to be 398 398 Reynolds number is less than 2300 this implies that this is laminar flow so when the flow is laminar the formula for hydrodynamic entry length LH is equals to 0.05 RE times D so this is 0.05 multiplied by 398 the Reynolds number which we got multiplied by the diameter which is 0.02 this comes out to 0.398 meter or 39 centimeter so the laminar uh, uh, entrance region is quite uh, 39 centimeter now let's move to part C where the diameter is 30 centimeter okay so here we are going to put only 0 0.03 the rest remains same so the Reynolds number RE comes out to be 5970 if Reynolds number is greater than 4000 then this is called a turbulent flow when the flow is turbulent then the formula is LH is equals to 10 times the diameter so this is 10 into 0 0.02 so it comes out to be 0 0.2 meter or 20 centimeter so you can see that if the pipe uh, diameter increases then the flow becomes turbulent but Dublin has a lesser uh, hydrodynamic entrance length. So this was the numerical for uh, hydrodynamic entry length and in the next section we are going to learn about losses in piping. And this is all about the Reynolds number turbulent and laminar flow. What is uh, how to detect whether a flow is turbulent or laminar and then how much is the entrance length of a uh, flowed when it entrance, uh, enters a pipe.